The commissioning and use of the compressor for bubble formation is simple and can be carried out by a specialist in just a few minutes. The compressor prevents soiling and condensation in pressure hoses with lengths exceeding 10 meters for lifting stations and pump stations that are air pressure controlled. Before you begin, make sure that the system is disconnected from the power supply. First, install another PE pressure hose between the compressor and the system in addition to the existing ones. Use the supplied T-piece to connect one end of the hose as close as possible to the submersible pressure switch or the immersion pipe. Then connect the other end to the compressor. Now you can apply voltage to the control unit. After the following initialization, the language menu appears. Use the arrow keys to select each menu item and then confirm with OK. You can also set the date, time and type of system using the same procedure. The system type is located on the type plate of the system. After selecting the appropriate maintenance interval, the system performs an initial function test. Note that the preset values must always be adapted to the local conditions. To set the control unit to compressor operation, go to the settings menu and select sensor configuration. Then confirm the mounted sensors with the add-on bubble formation by pressing the OK button. Since the water level changes when the compressor is started, make a note of this before plugging in the compressor. Now you can plug in the compressor and you will see a higher water level. To correct this, you must go to the settings menu and select air compressor offset under the parameters then and enter the difference between the old and the new water levels.